coming off the Beavs' biggest win of the season. A huge victory for Oregon State inside Pauley Pavilion. Just to see their faces after that game and just the excitement, and it was just special. I mean, that's that's what I play for, honestly. As a senior, as I, I play to make those younger kids and just my teammates in general to have those special moments. It was the signature win Scott Ruick's squad had been building for, knocking off number eight UCLA in Pauley Pavilion, putting Oregon State firmly in control of their NCAA tournament destiny. And who else to lead the charge but Aaliyah Goodman? Coming out on top of that, it does show everyone else that Oregon State's not a program to be messed with. The lone senior to play for the Beavers the last three years, Goodman scored seven of the final ten points. Uh, it was just special. I mean, you come to Oregon State for those type of games and for those wins. For as clutch as her shooting and defense are on the court, they pale in comparison to Goodman's leadership off it. As COVID forced the Beavers' schedule to pause more than most in the Pac-12, Goodman focused on finding new ways to reach her teammates. Communication has been something that I've really worked on and checking in on on my team all the time because this year is so weird and it's hard. It's not like we can go out to dinner. So I think just making sure I've been really, really careful and really persistent with checking in on my teammates and just making sure everyone's doing good mentally, physically, all that stuff. Making sure they know I care and I'm there for them and I want to help them. and. Hey, I might know, not know or I might not have an answer, but we're going to get through it together. Sunday could be Goodman's final regular season game as a Beaver. And if it is, the legacy she hopes to leave in Gill Coliseum is one that brings a smile to Beaver Nation. I just want to be remembered for like my joy, um, my smile and just love for the game. But most importantly, importantly, my love for my teammates and just this program. For Coin6 Sports, I'm AJ McCord. Couldn't help notice, but all the fans in the arena. Well, tomorrow, in the interest of fairness, AJ is going to have a feature on Oregon's Niera Sabali. She's the younger sister of Satu. We'll hear about her journey to playing at Matthew Knight Arena on Sunday and how that's been really anything but easy. That's 24 hours from right now, right here on Coin 6. By the way, we've got a bunch of men's hoops tonight as well. Nothing but basketball on our minds, unlike Natasha, who...